Now continuing on part three of our uh, rebuilding the edge flow, I'm going to go to object mode and snap back in this ear. And the geometry is going to be just a little bit different than I had it before. And that is okay. So before I snap it back together, I'm going to go to vertex mode. And I'm going to modify the sculpt on this. And it looks like it's actually just going to snap right in with very little modifications to the vertices, which will be nice. So I'm going to turn off soft select and hold V and just start vert snapping. It looks like I might have one extra. It's okay. Everything else is snapping in nicely. Uh, this extra one, it's fine. I'm just going to insert an edge loop right about here. And now I can snap that in. So I can select these two objects and go to Mesh Combine. Go to my Merge Edge tool. And you don't have to extract the model, but I find that in certain instances it just makes it easier. That way I can change the geometry and just put it back together and not have to worry about it edge flow throughout the whole entire ear, especially if I like the edge flow. So I can average my verts. And I'm going to finish merging this. So now what I'm going to do is just a little bit of sculpture and reattach this all back together. Okay, so now I've attached the neck. I'm going to do what I've done in the past before and I already straightened out well, I'm, excuse me, I'm going to straighten out this middle edge holding X. Now make sure in order for this to work, it has to have comp component spacing turned off. It also needs to be in world space in your move tool settings. So I'm going to right click, go to object mode, mirror my geometry. And I'm going to merge my geometry. So mesh, excuse me, edit mesh and merge. Again, soften my normals. Delete my history. And then I'm going to make sure that I name the model. So I'm going to double click here in the channel box and give the name of pig mesh. And I think it looks pretty decent. It has good edge flow. And good edge flow into the shoulders. You can see the shoulders go up and over the arm. Also, I think better edge flow around the mouth. And I like the edge flow around the eyes and the head. Total count is a little bit higher than 1700 polygons. And that is a lower res finished pig.